up when he thinks it's gonna happen. Except the guys in this room, and that's all that matters. Yeah. That's why you play the game, brother. Yeah, TNT, Smiley G, 12 men stand up. Let's go. Yeah. Uh -huh. You know about the team. Man, it's a great time to be a Seahawks fan. Blue jeans, I tell you what. If you tell me at the beginning of the year when you drafted Wesley Wilson and you say we're going to be 7 5, only half a game behind the fine downers with four games left in the season. And we had a chance to go to the playoffs and win the division. I was, I was told him no. Ain't no way in hell that was gonna happen. But I like to be wrong, of course. I like to be wrong when it comes to these kind of scenes. Man, oh man, Russell Wilson, man. He has the highest passer rating in the entire. We for the past several weeks higher than Andrew what? RJ Free, Peyton Manning for crying out loud. A higher passing rate than Peyton freaking man. How does that happen? I don't know, but I may like it. If you're not with the Hawks, you're an offering. Let's see here. We beating any team that try to face us. Play off. I really Seahawks. like our chances of winning the division right now. Because the last three out of the four games, we're going to be at home against 49ers, Cardinals, and the Rams. That means Cardinals, 49ers, Rams. It's just amazing to see that a rookie quarterback can lead a team to be at this point in the season 7 and 5 and have a chance to go to the playoffs and have a chance to win the division is on photo. I never saw that happen before with any rookie quarterback before this year and I gotta say with Russell Wilson the way he's playing and we have three out of the last four games at home I really like this chance if we win the last four games and the 49ers need to lose two two games then we win the division. I haven't been able to say that for the past couple of years, but I'm saying it now. And man, it is feels good. Boy, does it feel good to be in this position that we are in right now. Not only did we come up off an a impressive win over the Bears last week but we did it with a rookie callback who now we led the Seahawks on one one drive well 80 plus yards but two the last drive coming in overtime went 80 yards for the score and that what really impresses me is that Russell Wilson can take the team on his back and not buckle on the pressure. If you said that we're going to be in this position at the beginning of the year, I would, go, I would have said, fucking crazy, man. I'm with the Bootsy Cole back, and I'm glad I'm wrong. Uh. Well, I, I gotta say, I'm very impressed with Watson Wilson last week in the game against the Bills. He 
He marched the team down 97 yards to go and have the school a much need touchdown to take the lead. 97 yards to take the lead and pass the gun tape. He scored for 14 yards out. Wilson to Tate, Wilson twice, Marshawn Lynch. If we get him going again, we'll be unstoppable. We really will be. Marshawn Lynch only had 89 yards last week and a touchdown against the Bills. The most important thing is Russell Wilson has it for the inception. In the past two games, which I'm really glad about, he has a higher passing rating, and we're gonna be at home, free, out full for the rest of the season. With the 12th man, I really like those odds. Well, that's about does it for me for today. Um, Go ahead and then go to my Facebook page and give it a like. The link is going to be in the description down there. Um, that's it for me. I'd like to say, Go Hawks!